Can you believe the nerve on that girl? Yes, I'm talking about the cashier. Stupid Sarah. The way she was looking you up and down with her pervy little eyes while she scanned your items. Well, you're obviously with your girlfriend, no less. I can't believe how little shame she has. You're mine. You're so obviously mine. You smell like my perfume and... You know, at just the right angle, you can see what I left on your neck. <sighs> oh really? You think she was just being professional? <sighs> Please. She was obviously flirting. I knew that girl from high school. She only does that stupid, ugly laugh when she's making her sleazy little passes at someone. And besides, the way she just casually mentioned how she was single while making supposedly professional small talk, that's not a thing normal people do. I mean, I know I'm not exactly an authority on normal people things since I stalked you for a bit before we got together, but you know I'm right. And she's single for a reason, you know? None of her exes could put up with her for long. I don't blame them. And she even mentioned her age too, like, What the hell? That's not small talk. That's flirting. With you. The love of my life, and I'm the only one who should say anything even remotely flirty to you. And by the way, she lied about her age, you know. Subtracted a few years. See, she's such a dirty liar. I'm honestly surprised she was even wearing the correct name tag. I can't believe her. I wonder if she locks her door. Hmm? Hey? Baby? Could you look at me? Look into my eyes. I just... I need to be healed. That's the stuff. You have such beautiful eyes, sweetheart. I could look into them forever. They are the most beautiful things I've ever seen. Did you know that? Well, you must know it since I'm prone to blowing up your phone with messages telling you how gorgeous they are. Can't blame me there. <laughs> Okay, maybe you can, but don't. They are really pretty, though. They are so pretty, I sort of wish you would wear sheets outside. I get so jealous when anyone other than me looks into your eyes. It tears me apart that you show the most beautiful part of yourself to others for the entire world to see. You're mine. You belong to me. I mean that. Respectfully, of course. But seriously, you really do belong to me. I'm the only one who should be looking into your eyes. No one else. No other girl. Especially not that piece of trash, Sarah. <sighs> I'm still so upset. I'm pretty sure that's her car parked by the front. I could slash her tires, but not with all these cameras. I wonder if there are these many cameras by her house. <sighs> Never mind. Baby? Thank you for healing me. <laughs> Looking into your eyes really does that. But I still need you to heal me more. Could you be good for me and hold my hand? There we go, baby. Shh, no, it's, it's okay. Your hand doesn't feel sweaty to me. It feels perfect. It feels just perfect to me. The hand of the most wonderful person in the world. My one and only sweetheart. 
Thank you so much. You're being so good to me, baby. You know just how to treat me, right? You're so precious. That's why I have to keep you all to myself, sweetheart. I can't leave you to other girls. Especially not to one like Sarah. They'll only hurt you. Hey, you love me and not Sarah, right? She's a horrible girl. And a horrible girlfriend. She's done nothing but complain about every lover she's ever had. She complained about you too. Even though she was always the problem. She complains they're cheap when she's a gold digger. She complains they're clingy when she's the one who's so unreasonably distant. She even has the gall to call them superficial when she's the one who really fits the bill. But I know you're not any of those horrible things, sweetheart. You always treat me so right, baby. And I know to appreciate that. That's why you love being mine. Right, sweetheart? Because I treat you right, right back. Because you, of all people, know how much of a pleasure it is to be mine. My mark on your neck can attest to that. You'll be the happiest staying as mine. So don't forget that. Okay, baby? Be good and don't forget it. Now... Can you be good for me and tell me that you love me and not Sarah? <laughs> Thank you so much, baby. One more time, please. <laughs> You're so good to me. You're the greatest. One more time. Just one more time, I promise. Just give it to me one more time, baby. I just need to hear it once more. <laughs> You're perfect. You're flawless. I don't know what I did to deserve having you. You're so precious. I don't want to let you out of my sight. I love you. I love everything about you, baby. I really do. Not like Sarah. Do you really think that superficial girl would love everything about you like I do? She doesn't even know what love is. She can never compare to a love as deep and intense as the one I have for you. <laughs> I love everything about you. I love your laugh. I know you're a little insecure about it, but to me, it really is the cutest laugh in the entire world. How could it not be when it's yours? I keep recordings of it on hand just so I can replay it. It's that good. And I love it so much that I get so jealous when anyone but me hears it. And I love the face you make when you're sleeping. I used to always sneak in to see it, remember? You always look so cute and peaceful. It makes me want to protect your sleep no matter what. Like, I should just get up and completely murder anything that even remotely tries to disturb me asleep. I just have to protect you at all costs. To that extent. That's just how you make me feel, baby. And I love the way your hand feels in mine. When we're locking fingers like this, it makes me feel like you're truly mine. And you are truly mine, of course. But holding your hand like this really gives me that feeling. 
like I got you where just I want you. You're not gonna get away from me. Not while I have my worry hand on you. Not that you want to get away. <laughs> because you were meant to be mine. What would you do without me? You'd just be lost without me. I'll always protect you. I'll always protect you from your loneliness and I protect you from your bad little thoughts. All those bad little thoughts that tell you you're not worth it. I make sure to always let you know you are. Don't I, baby? You're worth my love, my affection, my attention. I let you know with every part of myself. Whenever you feel lost, I hug you and I tell you it's okay to feel lost. I tell you it's okay. It's okay, baby. Because I'm here. I'm here to guide and support you. And sometimes if you don't know what to think or do, you can always rely on me. And I'll think for you and do what's best for you. You can trust me, baby. Because I love you so much that my very life depends on you. <sighs> that stupid Sarah would never do any of that for you. Because Sarah is just a sad, shallow woman who can only think about herself and no one else. <sighs> but I only think of you. Sorry, I I know I'm coming back to Sarah a lot here. I know you already assured me that you love me and not her. I know I should really have just dropped it already. It's just that my relationship with you it's it's the sweetest thing in the world and she's trying to destroy that. She's trying to take the joy out of both of our lives. <laughs> it makes me hate her so much. She deserves to be hated. It makes me think of what I could do to her, like what I could leave her in the mailbox, like anything I'd do to her, she deserves worse. Really. I hate it when girls try to take away what's mine. Why are they always trying to interfere? You're mine. You belong to me. I'm the one who takes care of you when you're sick. I'm the one who comforts you when you're stressed. I'm the one who keeps you company on lonely nights. I'm the only one who cares for you like this. That's what makes you mine. You're mine because it's the right thing for you. I'm the only one who cares for you like this. That's... That's what makes you mine. You're mine because it's the right thing for you. And you're only mine. Isn't that right? Baby? Uh, tell me, who do you belong to? You only belong to me, right? Uh, right, right, that's right. You only belong to me. Thanks for saying it, baby. Obviously, you're mine, but I just really like hearing you say it. You are so good to me, sweetheart. I should really reward you. When we get home, you can ask for anything you want. I'll give you whatever you ask for. No matter what, I won't say no. 
and they really mean anything. <laughs> I can't believe this girl. Look, she's staring at us from out the window. Way to kill the mood. Can't she just mind her own damn business? She has no business looking at us. And she definitely has no business looking at you. <laughs> Wait. I have an idea. Hey. Baby? You know what would really get under Sarah's skin? Since she's watching us, how about a kiss? Mm-hmm.